In this video, we will learn how to identify the equations and how to build an equation from the given information. So far, we have understood that there is a restriction on the equation with a variable. Its left hand side and right hand side have equal values. This is expressed by the symbol of equality. Each equation has only one solution that satisfies the equation or condition. With some examples, we will understand equations more thoroughly. Example 1. Explain which of the following expression is an equation with a variable. The equation must have one or more variables and the left hand side must be equal to the right hand side. 25 minus 12 plus 8 is equal to 5. The sign of equality is between both the sides, but variable is not present on either side. There are only fixed numbers. So, we will call it numeric equation 5z plus 4. This does not have two sides. So, it is not an equation. It is an algebraic expression. x plus 5 lesser than 2. It has two sides, but they are not equal. So, this is also not an equation. 7r minus 9 is equal to 2. It has two sides and they are equal. So, this is an equation. 9t into 2 greater than 7. It has two sides, but they are not equal. So, this is not an equation. y by 13 plus 2 is equal to 1. It has two sides and they are equal. So, this is an equation. Next example. On dividing some fruits into two equal parts, each part consists of 10 fruits. Express this statement in the form of an equation. Here, we do not know the number of fruits. Let us represent it with the variable n. We have to make two equal parts of n fruits. Thus, we have to divide n fruits by 2. In this way, the number of fruits in each part is n by 2. But we know that the number of fruits in each part is 10. This means the value of n by 2 is equal to 10. Therefore, n by 2 is equal to 10. With the help of the information provided, we can build an equation n by 2 is equal to 10. In this way, we learned how to identify the equations and how to build an equation from the given information. In the next video, we will deal with misconceptions related to equations.